Hey guys, what is up? Hi and welcome back to Blue Elixir. Today I'm going to bring you a new tutorial and a little tips and tricks on uh, Windows. Now, really what this is all about. Now, I'm pretty sure that the most of you that are here are wondering uh, how to delete that weird message every time you want to delete a file. So I made this random file here and let's say I want to delete this thing. I go delete and it asks me and I hate every time this thing asks me. Like if you've ever been on a like um, uh, Windows 8 you know system you know uh, they don't ask you for this and it's it's pretty useful actually. It, it, I mean it say trust me it does save a lot of time. It doesn't feel like it but it, it usually takes more than a second, not for some people, if they're really used to it, I guess not, but um, I find it really annoying, so, you know, I've been struggling to find a way to disable this weird thing, um, or whatever you want to call it, but <laughs> yeah, so anyways, um, to do that, um, what you need to do, as you can see now, it's going to ask me to delete it, and of course, you need to click yes before being able to even deleting it, and now it's in the trash can, so I'm going to go ahead and restore that, and I'm going to show you once more, uh, how to make it like not give you this weird message now to do that all you need to re now it's really simple I just want to say that uh, all you really need to do is right click the re recycle button click on properties and you should see this little tick box at the bottom here saying display delete confirmation dialog now what you want to do is you want to simply want to untick that then you want to click OK and now from now on every file that you will delete every file that you will just simply move into the recycle bin even dragging or I guess that's default but um, anything that you will put inside the recycle bin it will not ask you for a confirmation before doing it now all you need to do is obviously just selecting it deleting it and as you can see it's already in the recycle bin now this can actually be really useful uh, uh, you, I can't even talk sorry useful uh, if, if you're using a lot of files at the same time let's say you're making a uh, like uh, you're a uh, mixing files or just you know dragging files in different places you have like you know unnecessary files or just old files that you want to delete really like uh, you know, but um, I guess this is a really fast way to do it. You know, it's faster. But um, uh, yeah, and of course you can always empty the recycle bin if you feel like it, eh, nearly permanently. But <laughs> yeah, so um, I guess that's about it. But anyways, guys, uh, I hope this helps some of you out out there that wanted to know how to kind of do this. Now, even though you didn't want to know how to do this, I guess it could be kind of useful, anyways. But um, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, once again, thanks for watching, and as always, become a Lexer today by subscribing to my channel. And if you have any questions, any errors by doing this, you know, you can leave a comment down below. And uh, if this did help you out, if you were looking for this video, uh, you can leave it a thumbs up. You know, it really makes my day. And uh, yeah, that's about it. So, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out.